Section ten of Goblin Market and Other Poems by Christina Rossetti. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Noble Sisters. Now did you mark a falcon, sister dear, sister dear, flying toward my window in the morning cool and clear, with jingling bells about her neck? But what beneath her wing? It may have been a ribbon, or it may have been a ring. I marked a falcon swooping at the break of day, and for your love, my sister dove, I frayed the thief away. Or did you spy a ruddy hound, sister fair and tall, went snuffing round my garden bound, or crouched by my bower wall, with a silken leash about his neck, but in his mouth may be, a chain of gold and silver links, or a letter writ to me? I heard a hound, high-born sister, stood baying at the moon. I rose and drove him from your wall, lest you should wake too soon. Or did you meet a pretty page sat swinging on the gate, sat whistling, whistling like a bird, or maybe slept too late, with eaglets broidered on his cap and eaglets on his glove? If you had turned his pockets out, you had found some pledge of love. I met him at this daybreak. Scarce the east was red, lest the creaking gate should anger you, I packed him home to bed. O oh, patient sister, did you see a young man tall and strong, swift-footed to uphold the right and to uproot the wrong, come home across the desolate sea to woo me for his wife? And in his heart my heart is locked, and in his life my life. I met a nameless man, sister, who loitered round our door. I said, her husband loves her much, and yet she loves him more. Fie, sister, fie, a wicked lie, a lie, a wicked lie! I have none other love but him, nor will have till I die. And you have turned him from our door, and stabbed him with a lie? I will go seek him through the world, in sorrow till I die. Go seek in sorrow, sister, and find in sorrow too. If thus you shame our father's name, my curse go forth with you. End of section 10